this drama screen with the beautiful Tracy Bursall. I interviewed you last year for Who's Jenna? Do you remember that? Yes, I do. Absolutely. That's when I heard your name. I'm like, oh, yay. <laughs> it was over the phone to finally meet you in person. Yeah. You're more beautiful than you are in pictures. Aw, thank you. <laughs> so, um, Rogue Warrior, congratulations on that. How, do, how does it feel now? Thank you. Warrior. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. I mean, this was a huge film. Mm. It's so much work and so much physicality and so much emotional work and I mean literally a year in production like two months in solid production but then it was always like Neil Johnson was always going all Peter Jackson on me it was like we need another shot we need another this we need another action scene we need I mean literally three weeks ago was the last shot we did yeah literally. we had wow. the score done we had the music done we had everything done and all of a sudden he's like I need one more spot and I'm like okay you know so to have it actually come out I mean it's just amazing now a lot of uh, heroines I can say in, in the sci-fi world over the years you know Ripley and all those girls mm -hmm. and Alice uh, so now that now you how does it feel to be on that same rank? Amazing. <laughs> Amazing, yeah. yeah. Well, especially because I'm a, I'm a fitness buff and I'm really yes. into, you know, I'm really great endurance. I'm a fighter and all those things. So I always knew it's like, I, I can could, I could do such a good job at one of those roles. But what's cool is that this one is, is so different than any of the ones that we've seen. So if you're staying to watch it, it's, um, it's a character-driven journey. And I'm telling you, this character gave me PTSD. I mean, it was just really intense intense and so I, it, I think it stands sets a whole new standard as far as you know female action heroines so I'm really excited about that and, and lots of visual effects right I'm, I'm, I'm there's guessing, a lot of visual yeah. effects but as much as possible is real mm. very little green screen wow. because his last two movies he did a lot of green screen and he's like I'm over this I want the real dirt the real grit the real you know and so you know when she's limping or when some it, she's really hurt mm. you know and when she's doing things it's not being overlaid on something it's real okay. and so of course some of the robots are green screen and stuff but a lot of that isn't even so a lot of that is real All right. so it's it's um, yeah it's very exciting are you gonna stick around in the world of action sci-fi or are you gonna come back to comedy like who's Jenna so once in a while or how do you mix your gigs I like to stay cross genre because I don't want to get pigeonholed of course and I've been an actress for a long time so actually this year I have two science fictions coming out and I have two comedies coming out I have diary of a fat man which actually screens on Sunday so I like to go back and forth and keep all those muscles active so that when somebody says can you do this I'm like absolutely all right yeah. awesome thank you so much and congratulations on Rogue Warrior